सो हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू बिल्ड अ गैस सेंसर विच आई हैव मेड यूजिंग सिक्स और सेवन कॉम्पोनेट एंड इफ यू डिड एंड सब्सक्राइब अवर चैनल प्लीज सब्सक्राइब अवर चैनल ऑल्सो प्रेस द बेल आइकॉन दैट यू गेट नोटिफाइड वेन एवर आई पोस्ट न्यू वीडियोज फ्रेंड्स बिफोर स्टार्टिंग दिस वीडियो देर इज अ स्मॉल मैसेज फॉर ऑल माई व्यूवर्स प्लीज डोंट स्किप दिस मैसेज दिस मैसेज कैन सेव अवर लाइफ एज वेल एज अदर्स सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड फ्रेंड्स You would know about this pandemic virus known as corona virus which has spread worldwide. In India, it has the most covid recoveries and there is a huge risk between this positive news. Every one out of 3 covid patient have severe lung damage and air pollution can be fatal for such patients. Pollution can put every one out of 5 patients in critical condition. Maybe these deaths would not be counted as covid deaths, but thinking a little bit about their life is our responsibility there have been three or four covid patient in our area already but they have recovered for their safety we are not bursting crackers this year burning waste of stubble is anyway dangerous for us but now it can be deathful but there is a good news rajasthan and odisha have totally ban of using cracker and selling crackers for the safety of covid patients we need to take such decision to reduce air pollution in india it feels very good when people in society come together and understand the circumstance and take this decision together please understand this is not a matter of religion this is the matter of humanity of some sense and consideration i can't force anyone but i can request you to look at the larger picture we need to control air pollution at our individual level we owe to those 76 lakh people who are at risk ultimately are the chances of a second wave in india more people think we have defeated covid no second wave will come then we will have second wave sure because we will stop taking precaution and if more people believe that a second wave will come then they take as many precaution as they did in may then maybe we can control the second wave but we are 8 months into this covid pandemic but we don't know how to wear mask properly please share this video who wear mask like this this or this till the time we don't have a vaccine and it reaches to everyone we haven't won the fight against covid 19 best news over here is that you get to decide the india's future because wearing mask is in your hand Reducing air pollution is also in your hand and cooperating and not being covid yet is in your clean hand. So friends, this was a small message for all my viewers. Don't forget to share as much as you can. This is very important message. And now let's get started to make our LPG gas sensor. So why to waste time? Let's go right into the video. For this project you will need a 4 volt battery and a red LED light. You also need a MQ6 LPG gas sensor and buzzer. Also switch and some wires. To make the box you can use plastic sheet. But I am not using this plastic sheet. I am using this sheet made by MDF piece. Now let's go for the wiring. At first, I have took two wire from the buzzer's positive point. One wire goes to the switch and from the switch it is connected to the 4 volt battery's positive point and another wire goes to the VCC point of the LPG gas sensor. From the ground, it goes to the minus point of the 4 volt battery and the output point goes direct to the buzzer's negative point. Hold a red LED light in the buzzer's positive and negative point. You can check in the wiring diagram. I have fixed all my components with super glue and sold long wire from the 4 volt battery. Why that I will say in the video. 
सो स्टे ट्यून Also I have soldered a red LED light Now let's test this You can adjust the sensing point by screwdriver Please slow down your volume Now I have fixed all my MDF piece with super glue. And as I told in the video, I had took long wires from the 4 volt battery because to charge the battery, you can open this door. It acts like a door. And remove the battery outside and charge the battery. So if you don't know to make this type of door I will show in this video Take a MDF piece and cut around 3 or 4 cm MDF piece Now take a black gum tape and keep the mdf piece like this and tape with the black gum tape now it's ready we should add few drop of super glue here See here I added few drop of super glue Now our door is opening To close the door I am making a lock I have take this type of hooks which you can get in tailor shop I have took two hooks and a thread. This is our desi jugad lock. Now you can remove the battery and charge the battery. I will make a special video on how to charge the 4 volt battery. So if you want to watch that video, please subscribe our channel. Also press the bell icon that you get notified whenever I post new videos.
Now it's not looking better. Let's change the color. One, two, three. So friends, how is this look? Let me know in the comment section. I have made a small hole in the back side of this sensor that you can hang and keep in kitchen or somewhere. Now let's see what is use of hole. See this way you can hang this sensor. And now it's time for doing main testing. You can also hang this sensor here or anywhere. So friends, how was this video? If you have any doubt about this circuit, let me know in the comment section below. And if you are new here, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Also, press the bell icon that you get notified whenever I post new videos. Thanks for watching. Stay safe, stay creative. See you all soon.